فجرى نعم على قدره نعم ما معنى جرى إن الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات لهم جنات تجري من تحتها الأنهار تجري تجري من تحتها الأنهار Allah Ta'ala says about those who believe in him and do good deeds لهم جنة they will have paradise تجري من تحتها الأنهار تجري من تحتها الأنهار well they will be in paradise but what it flowing what it flows in paradise? Anhar. Anhar, jama' nahar. Ma mana anhar? River. But anhar, rivers. So the rivers, tajri, they flow. So not only does Allah Ta'ala have control of everything, right? Ali ma kulla shay'in. He has knowledge of everything. Qabla kaunihi. Before it comes into existence, and then. All of that, once it comes into existence, فَجَرَى عَلَى قَدْرِهِ Everything flows according to his qadr, to his measure, to his determination, to his power. So when you read that verse, تَجْرِي مِنْ تَحْتِهَا الْأَنْهَارِ Rivers flow. Everything comes into existence flowing. This actually, this is actually very interesting. Not only, obviously, what he writes here in his observation, because what you'll notice is that to a great degree, and this is why uh, Ibn Abi Zayd, rahimahullah, is like such a revered scholar amongst all the Muslims, Sufi, Salafi, you know, whatever. Everybody kind of likes him, especially his muqaddima, is that he bases a lot of what he's saying and sort of paraphrases the Qur'an. So that's why I did choose it because it's a it's a it, a lot of the book is paraphrasing Quranic vocabulary and terminology. So it's like a win-win. You're studying the Quran, you're trying to memorize Quran, and uh, Ibn Abi Zaid is then going to use that same kind of data set, so to speak, and paraphrase it. So it, it, it helps to reinforce it. It's interesting how the secular world is always playing catch up with the Quran. So this idea of كل شيء اتفجرا على قدره Everything comes into creation like جرا على قدره It comes flowing. What is one of the things that they are now finally starting to understand in so-called quantum mechanics that is turning on its head and doing away with the old atomized understanding of particles that are divided even smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller and yet when you get to this ultra microscopic level, all of that gets thrown out the window. Total, total nonsense, a complete contradiction. Now they're understanding through quantum mechanics that there's essentially things exist as a field and you cannot separate those things in the field from the field itself. And what's interesting, the field is like a wave. This is what they're understanding now in quantum mechanics. And so things in existence flow. Right? And says so that a very incredibly astute observation by a man, rahimahullah, that lived a long time ago, before any of this stuff, but and yet is able to articulate what Allah Ta'ala says in his in his book that is very much in line with that. So it's a beautiful statement. Keep in mind to make a mark about that. What? Fa jara. Very beautiful statement. Alima kulla shayin. Everything flows according to Allah's qadr. 